Welcome back guys to our YouTube channel. This is Power CTV and um leo nataka tufanyie story ya um sana. Um kuna story nataka kutupea na hata mimi nataka kujua mambo. Poa sana. Hebu tuambie unaitwa nani? Mimi naitwa Cynthia. Mhm. Mm I'm from Nairobi. Unaendeleaje? <laughs> Niko poa Cynthia si nikufanyia lute school enda aze uli solve oh. na ule itali yako hapo. Ile loyalty tu mfinyifanyia last month. Mhm. Mm oh ilikuwa last month ama ilikuwa season anyway mli mli kata hapa ma what happened after hiyo loyalty test huyo mm -hmm. boy atukurudiana mm. kuli break up tu hivyo mli break up yeah. i hope sikuaribian god nafanya <laughs> late <laughs> hata nimekushukuru sana ulitufanyia poa mm -hmm. ana singejua kama na ni play yeah thank you so story so this is the main ambio kwa story nataka ku share hata mimi nataka kujua ni story gani <laughs> So ninataka ku share mm -hmm. the outcome ilikuwa after nilipata na after mlinifanyia loyalty test mm -hmm. yeah after that loyalty test mm -hmm. nilika single for around 3 uh, weeks 3 weeks yeah mm -hmm. nikaingia in another relationship yeah ni mtu uliko umeka kando ama ni mtu alikuatia <laughs> maybe ulikuwa umeka nini hapana <laughs> backup sikwa nimemweka mm -hmm. ni tu mpango ya Mungu mm -hmm. yeah sasa mm -hmm. huyu Charlie mm -hmm. nataka kuambia story yake vile tulipatana what went through kila mm -hmm. kitu yeah so ilikuwa hivi mhm mm nilikuwa long holiday so during long holiday auntie wangu anaishi Mombasa sasa kani call niende kwake nimtembelee kuna job fulani anataka kuniconnectisha mhm mm sasa mimi na furaha juu sijaienda Mombasa <laughs> ilikuwa first time yeah it was first time kwenda hey, Mombasa <laughs> siku fly mm. nilipanda SGR mm -hmm. my first time kupanda SGR kwenda Mombasa mm -hmm. sinajua tu hiyo furaha vile nakaanga nikapanga vitu zangu next day mm -hmm. kaenda mm -hmm. so kufika kwa aunti yangu akaniorganize story na job akanipeleka hiyo place ya job then nikafanywa some interview nika qualify then the next day nikaanza kazi mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. after nilifanya kazi the first day it was a good job nilifurahi sana nikamshukuru then the next day nilirauka tena nikaenda job niliingia i think around some mbili hapo mm -hmm ta kuingia kaenda kwa ofisi yangu kufika round saa sita hivyo hiyo saa sita ya mchana kaboy flani kakaingia kwa, kwa nini kwa ofisi yangu kaboy ama aman unajua kuna difference ya kaboy na aman no alikuwa mtu boy aman i think ni mtu anaka mbaba mbaba ama ah si aman ka kijana tu kadogo your age ama mdogo my age is okay yeah niseme tu ni rika yangu sasa lakini si mwanaume si kaungwa basi sasa tuseme ni aman sasa kaingia hata nilikuwa nadhani ni client kumbe ni one of my colleagues si kwa najua alikuwa mcute hadi nilimno kaniuliza jina yako ni nani so unajua mimi nilikuwa nadhani ni client so vile alikuwa analiza uliza vitu mingi nilikuwa zile what mbona hutaki nikusaidie mbona unaeuliza uliza vitu mingi alikuwa anauliza vitu kama gani jina yako ni nani? Okay. Unatoka wapi? Mm -hmm. Mamako anaitwa nani? Hizo vitu mingi zenye maboy wanaulizanga. Mhm. Mm Akitaka wakikukatia. Mm -hmm. So mimi nika sense labda huyu mtu ananitaka. Mhm. Mm na juu sifia mimi nilikuwa nimekwambia nilikuwa nimemtamani. Yeah. Usiniambie uliingia box the same day. <laughs> Siku ingia box the same day. Nilimsumbua mm -hmm. sumbua juu. Mm -hmm. Nilijua nikiingia box the same day, mm -hmm. ataona ti oh this girl is cheap. Nili nili. So unajua vile maboy wanakwanga. <laughs> Hata ukimit boy the first time then mm -hmm. oh tunaelewa okay na tuko <laughs> jipu so at least nilijifanya fanya mm. asijue my true colors don't mm -hmm. bother tamani kuingia box your day mm. so after meniuliza hizo vitu vitu mingi tukasumbwana akarudi mezi yake ya kazi mm. by the way aliniambia pia anawaka hapo so nikasema yes ni sasa tutapata na vizuri opportunity <laughs> <laughs> eh yeah. hey. So ikifika jioni mm -hmm. kaniambia see you come I read you home nikasema kaibisa Ako na gari wako kaboy kenye yeah, unaita kaboy Kako na gari hey, Kwani uh -huh. kila mambo anakwanga na gari even boys have cars Okay yeah mm -hmm. tukaenda home mm -hmm. kani drop hapo kwa beti anti yangu akarudi kwake So the next day ndo saa story ilianza kuwaka moto Mhm mm -hmm. <laughs> Anytime anafika tu kwa ofisi yangu anytime mm -hmm. anafika tu kama ni lunch ashafika breakfast ashafika So I think hata kwa na concentrate kwa kazi yake. Mm -hmm. So mimi nilikuwa naogopa labda naweza mwaribia kazi tufuze job na boss. Mm -hmm. Boss alikuwa mkali sana. Mm -hmm. So mimi sikuwa na otherwise. Sasa singemwambia ati sikuje kwa ofisi yangu. Mm -hmm. Tulikuwa tushaanza kupendana, mm -hmm. basi kwa nimeingia box. 
Alaji so tulugu kaenda kumpenda. <laughs> Iliabla kumpenda. Sasa okay. shida mm. siko nataka kuingia box the same day alinikatia mm-hmm. cuz niliogopa mm. labda naweza ona mimi niko cheap. Okay. Okay. Baada hata naogopa hivi. You played hard to get. Ya chini ya maji. Aha. Sasa after hapo mm. after ameingia kwa ofisi yangu akaniuliza Cynthia kwanza ni nil down as in kama na propose imagine a boy na propose the second day hata kama mjadate hamjajuana <laughs> eh ni mtu ako serious uh-huh. sasa nikasema kwa sababu ni sense ako serious nilijua ako serious uh-huh. juba the time boy a propose hadi ako na ring uh-huh. ndio ako serious sana sana alikupropozea yeah ni kwa zile za mimi na iko happy ring na moli tu wewe acha nitakwambia pe the ring ilienda the story okay okay so ina heart sana wa Ato mbona umeniambia mambo na ring? Sasa na bill kulia. Tuendele. See like you are happy you are proposed. So she proposed ama that was the first time. That was the first time. Okay. Mhm. Wa, na fili chungu vile umeendelea mambo na ring. Ah ah, sorry sorry, tunaendelea tu. Kuna shida cha tuniendelee. Mhm. Sasa ali kneel down na propose. Alikuwa na kari nyingine zilikuwa mbili. Moja alinivisha, nyingine nikamvisha. So alikuwa za will Cynthia Will you marry me? No ah, time. Ah, <laughs> no time I'm in the down. I'm going to say will you be my girlfriend like. Siata girlfriend, mm-hmm. will you marry me? Aish. Bro, you say my yes. The second day. Mbona ni waste time na nilikuwa nampenda? We. Wa eh. Kamwambia yes. Mhm. Kuna shida. Nataka mm-hmm. nivisha ring. Mm-hmm. So me hiyo time nilikuwa na feel ah na I'm somebody's woman. Hey. Yeah, I'm now married. Hey. Na hata imagine atuja date. It's the second day na me propose. Eh. Woo. Okay, ni kwa romantic sana. Mm-hmm. So after hapo I nilikuwa nimefurahi. Mm-hmm. Na imagine tu vile atanipeleka kwao. Mm-hmm. Vile kutakuwa. Mm-hmm. Nilikuwa na imagine tu. Then hiyo gari yake. Si unajua tu madem wakisha una boy yako na mali. <laughs> unajua tu hiyo gari ni yako, kila kitu ni yako. Ehe. Uh-huh. Nikasema hizo zote zitakuwa zangu. Mm. Little did I know that the man was blah blah blah. Ki acha tu nimalize. <laughs> Aki was chan. Kwa nini na uli propose you like now you are ready to be taken eh? si uliona hizo vitu zake then uko in love mm-hmm. sasa hata ufikiri yangu mbele mm-hmm. so sasa what happened niko curious what happened <laughs> after that i proposed mm-hmm. then akaniletea some gifts akaniachia hapo kwa ofisi yangu then akarudi place pake ya job mm-hmm. then kufika saa 8 hiyo time ya majioni mm-hmm. akani text eti leo usitoke job mapema I'll come and pick you from the office. Eh eh. Eh eh. Twende kwangu. Mm-hmm. So you kwa first time yangu ya kwenda kwake nione kwake. Okay. Kwa alikuwa ame request niende kwake nione kwake inakaje. Mhm. Wa kufika majioni 5 kwenda kwake. Mm-hmm. Kakuja kwa ofisi, kan kiss. Ah. Tunaje ile kiss ya romance. <laughs> eh. Uh-huh. Akakuni kiss, mm-hmm. tukaag. Mhm. Then tukatoka tukaenda kwake. Mhm. Yeah. So hata nilikuwa nashangaa izipitia supermarket ya buy vitu. Sinajua dem kama mimi napenda kubaiwa magift. Mhm. Akushuka. Mm-hmm. Then tukafika kwa ke. Mhm. Wakati kulikuwa kuna kaa poa ni apartment flani. Then niko 45 45 tuna get. Mm-hmm. I think ilikuwa compound yake. Sasa nilikuwa nashangaa kai. Huyu boy mdogo size yangu. Yaani ashakuwa na hizi mali zote. Mm-hmm. Nyumba kubwa hivi yako peke yake. Jua niliambia kuwa na family alikuwa tu single hivyo sasa nashangaa alianza kuwa na hizi mali kini mhm mimi nikasema ah niache kujisumbua na mambo mengi umeleta kwa boma labda kwa the rich mhm this is the day no mhm tukaingia kwa nyumba wah ukiingia kwa nyumba unaweza shtuka hata mm-hmm. kila kitu yani the room alikuwa na three bedroom kuna kitchen kuna sasa hizo pia lazima ni same Oso story una share una sema kila kitu. Yaani mjue tu it was a very nice house. Mm-hmm. Heaven. Ukiingia hapo unadhani uko heaven. Mm-hmm. Wa. Mm-hmm. But shida hiyo nyumba mm-hmm. kitu ilinifanya nikuwe curious sana. Hiyo nyumba iko empty. Sitting room kuna kiti moja ile inakaa kama za king. Mm-hmm. Na inatisha. Ukikaa hapo unaweza shtuka hata saa hata mimi sikukaa. Mm-hmm. Then hizo bedrooms tatu, mm-hmm. moja kuna bed. I think alikuwa analalia moja. Mbili ziko empty hivyo. Jikoni hakuna hizo vitu za kupikia, iko tu hivyo. So nikamuuliza what? Mm-hmm. Mbona uko na nyumba kubwa hivi na hata kuna vitu? Mm-hmm. Akasema ah, wewe acha sio unajua ndo nimeanza life. Okay. Kamwambia okay ni sawa. Mm-hmm. Na upikangi? Mhm. Akasema yeye pikangi anaenda ku buy food. Mm-hmm. Kwa hoteli. Mhm. Akasema okay ni sawa. Mm-hmm. Then nikamwambia sasa vile vini mjaka hivi na napenda kukula food za kupika. <laughs> Unapenda au ni survive? <laughs> Ama unataka nikonde hapa kwako? Mhm. Jumi ni kwa nataka vile ulisha ni proposia. I stay here. Mhm. Nitaki kurudi kwa aunti yako. Mama, umeona Mombasa. 
Eh. Wewe kaniambia niache hizo itabidi. Mhm. Nizoe mambo na hoteli. Mm. Then nikamwambia okay ni sawa. Then akatoka, mm. aliniacha hapo. Mm. Akatoka, akafunga mlango. Mm. So nikamuliza, mbona saa unanitokea mlango na nikapa kwa nyumba? Kwani okay. ni nini naweza iba hapa? Alitoka akienda kununua food. Eh yeah, alitoka akienda kununua food. Akafunga na padlock. Yeah. Jua, niliona alitoka na shopping bag. That's why I thought alikuwa anaenda ku buy food mm-hmm. ya sapa. Mhm. Cuz ilikuwa around saa moja. Mm. Yeah, akafunga na padlock. Mm-hmm. So nilikuwa za guy. Mbona saa anafunga mlango? Na mimi niko kwa nyumba. Kwani mimi naweza iba na already asha propose mm-hmm. nikwe bibi wake. Mm-hmm. Alikata kunijibu akaniambia mimi nikae tu hapo nisijali. Mm-hmm. Anaogopa watu wanaweza kuja kunimba vile mimi mrembo. Ah, ah. <laughs> hey. He's insecure. He's insecure sana. Uh-huh. But haikuwa hiyo insecure. Maybe kulikuwa na something. Mm-hmm. You were your mimi. Wana sense vitu sana. Mbona sasa ananilokea mlango? Na hiyo mlango amelock na kivuli mbili, mm-hmm. moja juu na moja chini. Hizo vifuli ukiziangalia mm-hmm. zinakaa extraordinary. Uwezijua, yani ujai yona kifuli zinakaa hivyo. Kwani zilikuwa zinakaa? Singeni tungepiga picha. Like kama ukiona vitu extraordinary, unajua watu wanapenda kupiga picha vitu vya nyaya. Unaweza kupiga picha kwa jumla mtu hadi. Si ni um, your man. Ah. Labda naweza shukuru ni mwizi. Mbona unapiga nyumba yangu picha? Ni wewe bwende. Labda ningepiga picha kama yuko. Uh-huh. Aha. Safta amefunga. Mm. Niliacha maswali mob mm-hmm. cuz nilikuwa nime notice nikimuuliza maswali ni kama na jam jam ni ule mtu mwenye kwa mood cuz nilishaanza kumsoma sana mm-hmm. hataki kuuliza maswali anything hata kums, kumspy niliogopa sana kumspy mm-hmm. akaenda karudi tukakula mm-hmm. tuka watch watch kidogo then kuna tuka... tv ama mlikuwa mna watch kwa nini tulikuwa tuna watch kwa lapi hapo okay. na tv ni kiti pekee <laughs> asa mlikuwa mnaka wapi na ni kiti yake pekee ama mlikuwa kwa kitanda Hiyo time tuliingia tu kuingia kwa city nyunguka. Mm. Tulienda so oh, so bedroom direct. Bado mlikuwa mnakulia bedroom. Yeah, hiyo kiti hataki nikalie. Ah ah. Mhm. Sasa hapo tumekula, mm. fika saa tatu hivi, mhm, tukalala. Akazima light. Hata stories za tukupiga. Cuz na shuku walikuwa nadhani vile nilianza kushtuka, naweza muuliza maswali mingi cuz mimi mm. nakwanga mtu wa maswali mingi. Mm. Then akazima light, tukadoz. Mhm. Mm. Then sasa round uh, kitu saa 5 hivi mm-hmm. nikasikia kama mtu ana mkol na alikuwa analala kwa nasikia nikamtap vile unaweza tap mtu hivi amka mm-hmm. simu yako inalia mm-hmm. then akamka akakataa kushika hiyo simu nikamwambia si ushike hiyo simu mbona unataka kushika au kwa ona jina ama iko ana jina au kwa ona jina okay mimi nilikuwa inside ya wall mm-hmm. then yako these other side okay. so phone ilikuwa hapo kwa table so nikaweza uliza kwa hiyo bedroom hakuna hata kameza ama Sio na kwambia hiyo 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 phone mm-hmm. ilikuwa kwa meza. Okay. Mm-hmm. Hapo kando ya bed mbele yake. Mm-hmm. So singeona si mtu ana call. Okay. Akakataa kushika. Mhm. Ikaleta maneno nikamuuliza sasa ama uko na bibi mwingine mbona unataka kushika siri? Eh hey, madam, unataka ni devil. Tunajua ndio wewe ina run kwa mm-hmm. mind zetu yeah, si madam. Yeah, yeah. Kama mm-hmm. boy amekoliwa, yeah, ajashika yeah. simu, mm-hmm. then ika jam. Mm-hmm. Afa ku jam, kaniambia sasa umekuja kufura kwangu. Mimi mbaya na wewe. Mhm. Hivi ta must nishike simu ya kila mtu amen call. Mm-hmm. Then kamambia okay ni sawa mm-hmm. then tukalala mm-hmm. kumbe hiyo time mm-hmm. mwenye alikuwa amemcall alikuwa friend wake mwingine juu niliamka around saa saba kugeuka hivi kumshikashika inside simuoni uh-huh. kumbe huyo jamaa alimcall watoke nje waende uh-huh. ah mimi nilichukua so mtu ameenda wapi mm-hmm. kai simi kumuona yuko nikaamka nikafungua light nilingoje nikae hapo kwa ni kwa city ni kwa kiti. Eh hey, ulienda kwa hiyo ile kiti. Ile kiti yenye hata nikalie. <laughs> hey. Hui. Mm-hmm. Sasa nikakatu hapo, nikakatu hapo for long. Mm. Kufika saa kumi hivi mm-hmm. nafikia ni kama nafungua mlango. Then umejua aliingia kwa nyumba aje? Mm-hmm. Aliingia kwa nyumba kama kwa na chest wazi na ameva ka boxer. Umejua vile aliingia hivi akaniona nimeka kwa kiti akashout Cynthia why are you sitting there? Kusikia hivi nikashtuka nikaruka juu ya kiti. Sijui nilijipata kwa beda aje. <laughs> Uli fly. Sije nili fly ama nilibeba juju akanirusha kwa bed. Nikakuwa unconscious ndo nikamka nikajikuta kwa bed. So nikamuuliza, "Kwani uliingia kwa nyumba aje? Cuz nilikuwa uko na chest wazi na uko na boxer. Kwani mm. wewe ni mrogi ama wewe ni nini?" Akaniambia, "Wacha na mambo ma- mengi. Nilikuwa nimeenda tu kwa nje kufanya vitu zangu." Nikamuuliza, "Vitu zako gani? Mm-hmm. Zenye utaki hata kuniambia? Mm-hmm. Si ukitoka nje, 
unataka kuniambia unaenda wapi mm. at night hizo mm-hmm. shughuli zako usifanye daytime mm. kasema achana na mambo mengi siji nini nini then akaniambia wewe si mtia ni sawa kuona umekaa kwa hiyo kiti tena mm. i have my own reasons why na kuambia usikae kwa hiyo kiti sana so, tayari last time uliingia kwa nyumba mm. kuka kwa hiyo kiti mm. nilikwambia usikali have my own reasons nika mwana sasa babe mbona sana nisikae kwa hiyo kiti si ni nyumba yangu ni propose ni kwa bibi wako mm-hmm. so what's wrong kanyamaza tu hata feeling zake zilianza kuisha cuz I'm not very restrictive. Eh, yeah. kai ni nyumba gani hivyo uwezika kwa kiti? Mm. Then ngasema ni sawa. Mhm. Kama utaki nikuulize maswali, ni sawa nitakushika tu. Mimi najua kutai mtu. Hata kama ita take kitu 2 days ama hata 2 years nitajua mm-hmm. nini naendelea. Mm-hmm. But nishaanza kuwa suspicious. Mm-hmm. If you are not a witch, na ni kama nini? Vile nimwambia if you are not a witch, unajua ni ni slap. Ah uh-uh. ah. <laughs> nika sema sasa una ni slap na jana jana tu ndio propose the first day ali ni slap na ukishaona mwana ume kama huyo mwenye ako very moody ufai kumuliza vitu ujue kuna kitu ya yeah? mm. kwa open akuwe mm. mtu transparent kasema to it's okay nikavumilia jumi nilishavalishwa ring naona kuna magari hapo hey. well, <laughs> kiti na kaya king eh hey. bed ni heaven so ajaongelea kuhusu story na kununua vitu kwa nyumba ama Yaani ni mtu kimuuliza anything. Aizijibu. Aizijibu. Anataka tu akupige ako tu za hivyo. Mm. Ni mtu private na yuko transparent. Mm. Sasa mimi nilichoka. Kasema mm. acha tu nikaeka mtaona vile kutaenda. Okay. Cuz hiyo place nilikuwa naka. Mm. Ilikuwa tu heaven. Hata siko nataka kurudi kwa mti wangu cuz unatitiwa poa. Sasa nyumba inakaa jeven na ina fit. <laughs> Kama yaani hizo mali zake ndio zilikuwa zinanifurahisha. Little did I know that hizo mali ametoa wapi? Mm-hmm. Ana ningetoroka hiyo usiku alikuwa ametoka kwenda mazuri ya raza. Sasa tulikuwa kwa ulivipata kwa kitanda. Kwa kitanda? Mhm. After alikuja akapata umeka kwa kiti. Mhm. Sasa nilikuwa nimejipata kwa kitanda na kuja kuniuliza mbona nilikaa kwa ile kiti. Okay. Then I can slap. Mm-hmm. At least wewe kaiki kwa hiyo kiti. Nikamuuliza mm-hmm. mbona nisikae na mimi mm-hmm. bibi yako. Mm-hmm. Kasema achana na mambo mengi. Okay. Ukikuja hapa kwa mjuaji Hey. you land up dying. Ah, nilishtuka. Hey. Nikasema sasa hizo ni nini umeanza? Mm. Then after that, nikalala. Mhm. Nilala hadi kitu za mbili hapo. Mhm. Hadi nikasahau tunasaa kwenda job. Kuamka nikapata yuko tena. Kumbe hey. alienda job. Hizo maswali nilikuwa namuuliza alikuwa amejam. Sasa mtu kama huyo unaweza ishi na yeye. Sasa ulipata ameenda job. Ameenda job ameniacha hapo kwa nyumba. So mimi kwenda kufungua mlango afa nimejitarisha nikavaa niende job. Nipata tena amefunga mlango. Sasa siji mbona hapo anataka niende job. Then after hapo nikamcall. Nikamuuliza sasa mbona umenifanyia hivi vitu? Mm-hmm. Si nilifaa kwenda kazi ama unataka niharibu job nikae kama housewife kwa hiyo mm-hmm. nyumba yako. Mm-hmm. Hii nyumba yako empty. Mm-hmm. Kaniambia kuna pale unaenda. Mm-hmm. Au utakuwa unaenda job. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then kamuuliza mbona nisiende job? Mm-hmm. Si a woman must have how on money mimi sitakuwa na depend kwa pesa zako mara nikitaka kushuka ni kuombe pesa kila kitu ni kuombe pia mimi nafaa kuwa na pesa zangu mm-hmm. at least pia i give my parents money mm-hmm. cuz wazazi wana furaha ingi tuwapea pesa mm-hmm. ta depend kwa pesa zake for long then akaniambia utaenda pale hata utaenda job tena uh-uh. utakuwa unatumia pesa zangu sina ku provide kila kitu kwa hiyo nyumba kasema okay ni sawa kuna life inaanza kuwa ngumu. Like sasa anoki utoke kwa nyumba. Ataki nitoke na hiyo nyumba inakuwa locked. Huh? Sisi ninge kwa hiyo nyumba. Sije ona ta nje. Okay. Sije ata join na wakati. Sasa nikaenda kuuliza Sanja. Mm. Hiyo siku ulienda kwa kwa hiyo nyumba ulikuwa na the same clothes zenye ulikuwa umevaa. Sasa mm. ulikuwa na kati na hizo nguo zenye ulienda nazo hapo. Hapana nguo zilikuwa hapo. Alikuwa amenibaia. Ah ah. Sasa ni propose ni kuje ni kwa bibi yake. Alikuwa amebai kila kitu. Mhm. Sasa nikasema okay ni sawa. Mhm basi nilianza kuuzimika jimaji ninaka kwa nyumba the old day nyumba iko empty hakuna watu tunaweza ongelesha uko tu hapo kwako unangoja mtu wa kuje lunch mm. lunch alikuwa bebai kila kitu hapo ma snacks ndio nilikuwa nakula eh hawezi fika jo hakuna vitu hakuna kupika hiyo nyumba but kuna mm-hmm. kitchen mm-hmm. nilikuwa tu kama slave mm. then nilikuwa nangoja nikamngoja ngoja akarudi around saa kumi na moja kafungua mlango yake akaingia kanipata nimekaa bed Baada ya time nilikuwa nimekaa kwa hiyo kiti. Sasa kusikia amefunga blizu alikutishia huko na ni club. Sasa unajua next time labda ndio za disturb na knife. Mtu mm-hmm. kama huyu ujue vile anaka. Mm-hmm. Sasa nikaenda kuka kwa bed akanipata huko kwa bed nimefurafura. Mm-hmm. Vile nakanga kujam. Mm-hmm. Kaniza sasa msichana. Nimekuja mm-hmm. kufuria nani kwa nyumba yake. Kasema sasa after kunipropose ya nilikuja hapa unitese. Yeye akaniambia hapana. 
a woman anafaa kukishwatishwa ukiacha mwanamke hivyo atakukalia akasema basi kama hii ndio ilileta hapa acha nirudi kwetu mm. kasema kuna pale utarudi hata mm. na nini utakaa hapa utazimizalia watoto hapa na utawai ona nje tena a a hey, imagine ningekuwa wewe ndio situation ungefanya oh. nini hey, don't know <laughs> Yeah, it was mm-hmm. a very tough situation. Kai. Mm-hmm. Sasa after amekuja hapo, alikuja na some shopping, then tukakula sapa. Then sasa mimi nimefurahi na tunakula tu chakula na cooked food. Eh, tunakula na mimi simongeleshi because mimi nilichachoka na yeye. Nilikuwa na fine two ways naweza toka. But ananilokea mlango nisitoke. Na pia kuna rooftop unaweza jump toke toke. Kwa sababu bedroom ilikuwa iko juu, mm-hmm. ilikuwa third floor. So imagine ikiruka hata kama kuna karufto ya kurupia. So naweza umia. Mm-hmm. Nikakaa tu hapo, tukalala. Hata nililala na nguo, si kulala na night dress kama kila siku. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Akaniuliza Cynthia sasa, mm-hmm. mbona unalala na nguo? Mm-hmm. Mbona ulali na night dress? Kamwambia, "Kwa hiyo lazima nilale na night dress." Achana na mimi. Mhm. Jana kadaambia, "Utaleta kichwa ngumu hapa wewe mtoto." Mm-hmm. Kamula sasa sasa mimi ni mtoto. Eh. Na nilikuwa bibi yake. Mm. Okay, ni sawa. Mm. Then akaanza kunisumbua sumbua. Mhm. Nikamwambia mimi utanisumbua hapa. Mhm. Nikashuka nikaenda nikalala chini. Usingizi kanipeleka. Mhm. Sijui nilijikuta aje tena niko bed. Ni kama mm. nilibeba kanirudisha kwa bed. Mhm. Ilikuwa sana by then. Then nikalala. Mhm. Na hiyo time mimi simuongeleshi tumefuriana. Mm-hmm. Imagine such kind of a house ni watu wenge okay. na walikuwa wanapenda na kitabu. Mhm. Oh, sasa mm. uh, around kitu sana na hivyo. Mhm. Nikaanza kusikia some sounds. Mhm. Some sounds za makusipusi. Mm-hmm. Pusi zikilia, zikiruka ruka kwa roof. Mm-hmm. Nashangaa sasa hizi ni nini. Mm-hmm. Na siku muliza cuz nilikuwa najua na lala sasa niku muamsha. Tena all of a sudden after kitu 2 minutes hivi mm-hmm. zikanyamaza. Hata nimeongea hizo ni nini? Then nikishalala tena nikaanza kuzisikia zikilialia, zikirukaruka. Nini nini then pia na na feel zina migwara gwara. Sana shanga zikwa pili kishika shika hivi. Ana zizishiki na sketu vitu vina migwara gwara pusi zinalia. Then nikaamka, nikafungua light. Nifungua light tena zili. Mhm. So nikashanga wewe Aziz nao. Alafu nikamtapta hivi nimwamshe. Aniambia hizo ni nini? Then akakata kuniambia, "Ah, kadenda labda kuna jirani wetu hapa mwenye amefuga mapusi, labda hizo ndo zinalia." Then nikarudi nikazima light nikalala. After kulala around 3 minutes hivi tena nikaanza kuzisikia. Sasa hiyo time after kuzisikia nikafungua light. Huyo jamaa kwa kwa bed sasa. Sasa nilikuwa nachanga mienda wapi? Then kwenda kumtafuta tafuta kwa hizo rooms zingine simuone. Nikaenda kitchen simuone, kwenda bathroom simuone. Then uh, kwenda kwa mlango nikapata me lock tena vile wana lock. Ni kama hiyo time pia alikuwa ametoka nje. Sasa mimi nikarudi nikalala sana na shangaa hizi ni nini zina happen. Mbona huyu mtu anashinda shinda kutoka nje mm. na vitu zinafanyika kwa hiyo nyumba mm-hmm. zinatisha tusha tu. Mm. Ama huyu jamaa anakwanga witch mm. ama ku Illuminati. Kabili niombe do at least nisiogope ogope. Nikarudi nikalala. Kufika round don hapo masa kumi na moja. Nikaanza kusikia upepo zikivuma. Tunajua ile wave ya upepo kwa nyumba nikaanza kuzisikia nikashtuka ah, hizi ni nini sasa zinape na yule jamaa yuko hapo kwa nyumba hmm. sasa nikafungua light kufungua light nikaona yule jamaa amesimama vile alikuwa na chest wazi na boxa wazi sasa nikamuuliza umetoka wapi jamani na hiyo time nalia na shangaa na ndanga hapo kila siku hmm. nataki kuniambia ananianzia tuna ukali ni nini naniuliza mimi naendaga baziara zangu si nikamwambia kama utaki kuniambia peni peni unaendanga usiku hmm nitakushika tu na tunajua vile niliomba najua Mungu ataniambia kile zinaendanga ama itakuja ina dream na nitajua what the secret behind thing then akasema it's okay siku yenye utapata tutakuwa sawa na ukipenda uende uh-huh. nikalia nililia for almost 1 hour mm. after kunirudisha hivyo then kaenda nikalala akamka kaenda job vile naendanga akanifungia mlango hapo ndani akanisha hapo ndani ndio ngoja ya kienda kazi <laughs> utoke naye utatoka naye aje na ni mtu mwenye hata ako na nguvu kukushinda hata mm-hmm. anaweza kugonga mhm so mimi nikakaa hapo nikamlelea kwa kama mwanamke mhm nikakaa tu hapo 
Kasema tu one day mm. Mungu atanifungulia njia nitatoka mm. kwenye nyumba. Mm. Mimi nilikuwa nishaanza kuogopa sana. Mm. Kwa nilikuwa nimeanza ku sense hizo vitu za idudu na TV ni mati. Mm-hmm. Yaani ukirelate vitu zinafanyika kwa nyumba na hizo weza kwa nazo. Na pia nilituka boy kadogo. Mm. Yaani size yangu acha kuwa na hizo wealth zote. Mm-hmm. Kwa ujui wa kwaje. Yaani sikuwa nimemfai. Hadi nika regret. Mbona sasa nilingia kwa hii relationship na sijui mtu. Mm. Ah nilikuwa na mawazo sana nikaanza kukonda. Mm. My parents wa kinicol sishiki simu. Hadi yangu wa kinicol sishiki simu. Hawajui kinaz nilienda sasa. Kwa nini uko unashika simu? Time kama sasa kama ameenda kazi mm. na umepiga na mtu ama unge, unge jaribu kupigia mtu. Yaani hata uge kwa na mwenye kupigia mtu hizo ma stress tu. Cuz ukipigia mtu utaanzaje kumwambia story zako what's happening? Kumwambia wewe mm. uliolewa within one day. Utaanza kusema aje. Mm. Ikabidi tu nimemjinga mazia nitajitoza tu kwa ishi na pepe yangu. Mhm. Ndio nakaka kaa ikaka kaa. Mhm. Akarudi jioni tena job mm-hmm. akanipata hapo nimeka. Mhm. Then nikamwambia mimi by the way, mm. sasa hiyo time sikumita babe. Mhm. Nikamwambia mimi by the way, mm. Jared, I want to go home. Mm-hmm. Nimechoka kukaa hapa sana. Mm-hmm. Jutaki kuniambia more about you. Mm-hmm. Sijui watu wa kwenu. Mm-hmm. Ulisema nikikuja kwako mm-hmm. the next day utanipeleka kwa wazazi. Sasa mbona sasa hujanipeleka kwa wazazi? Naona tu vitu zangu hapa. Mara makisi zinalia usiku. Mara unatoka toka nje usiku. Mm-hmm. Narudi kiva box sana. Ngo nini? Mm-hmm. Shoulder wazi hivyo. Sasa hizo ni nini? Hizo ndio ulikuwa umenileta hapa kufanya. Mm-hmm. Tena kanislap. Akaniambia wewe msichana utanileta ujinga hapa. Utaka kwa hii nyumba for the rest of your life you are my slave hey. after you say my slave kai nilishtuka sasa nikamuuliza my slave again then akaniambia kwa nini ujui mimi ya my slave nikikwambia you are my slave wewe mm. uoni vitu zinafanyika kwa hii nyumba ujijazie mm-hmm. acha kuwa thick in mind akasema so you are in illuminati mm. mbona ukuniambia kaniambia kwani wewe ume unaona niko illuminati mtu akiyakwa ya wealth hivi yako illuminati acha kuwa na thick mind hivyo we utajua kila kitu ndio mimi. Jua tu wewe you are my slave. Mm. Nasema kwa ni sawa. Na time nimeogopa na shiva. Kila pale ni tu sweat, sweat, sweat. Nasema oh god. So what are these? Mbona sana pitia hizi mashida zote? Mm. Then kaniambia badala ya kukaa hapo enda ulale. Mimi unanibo hata. Oh. Akani kick. Unambo. <laughs> Sasa na mbo. Mm-hmm. Imagine wanaume wengine wana kwanga hivyo. Hiyo time ana propose. Mm-hmm. Anajifanya na kupenda. Hebu ende ukae na hivyo almost two, two weeks. Mhm. Sasa tuko na mama Zarau hivyo. Mhm. Then nikaenda tuko bedroom nikakaa kutoka yangu na nialia. Mhm. Hivyo hivyo. Then akakuja. Hata mikakaa hapo ametumia tumia simu yake aka watch watch. Mhm. Then akaniita Cynthia. Mhm. Sana wana una uzuni una uzuni sana. Mm-hmm. Mimi nakusumbua. Nikamwambia so hivi vitu naona kwa hii nyumba yako na hata nikiuliza maswali utaki kunijibu mm. unani slap unani kick unaniambia ni nyamaze nisikulize maswali mingi niache kuwa spy so nataka nikae hapa na wewe mbona jana kaniambia kama uko na idea ya kutoka hapa mama utatoka my dear mama mm-hmm. <laughs> akaza kujiita hivyo kaniambia hivyo nikamwambia mm. okay kama sitatoka ni sawa mm. bana hata tu one day nitatoka kwa hii nyumba through god mm. kaniambia wewe msichana usiwaita mambo na Mungu hapa. Ushaniona nikienda chacha hapa. Hata ushaniona Bible kwa hii nyumba. Akasema ishindwe katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Then akafanya mkono hivi. Sijui mkono alikuwa ameka nini hapo. Then akanifanya hivi. Nikaona masters kwa uso. Ah? Then my mind ikaanza mm. to run run na sika mm. kizunguzungu, mm-hmm. kichwa na nyuma. Mm. Nikalala. Mm. Ta that. Mm-hmm. Kifika around saa 4 usiku kaniamsha sinti mimi nataka kukwambia kitu. Eh. Mm. Anataka sasa kuopen up kama yuko. Ikinga leo hata kuopen up. Mhm. According to your story alikuwa hata kuopen up though mimi sikuwa najua. Mhm. Sinti fungua your light nataka kukwambia kitu. Mhm. Nikamuuliza nini wewe unataka kuniambia? Mhm. Do you know na kuanga Illuminati? Mhm. Kaniambia hivyo nika ishtuka Illuminati aje. Mbona hiyo time ulikuwa na nikatia huko niambia uko Illuminati? Mhm. Yeye akaniambia, "Unajua vile wewe una sense?" bade uko na high sensitivity sana. Mhm. Then nikamuuliza mbona? Mm-hmm. Juu unaona vitu hapa mm-hmm. una think to of illuminati. Mhm. My dear, mimi niko illuminati. Don nilikuwa nakupenda sana that. Tabidi tu u accept the situation. Kama ndani accept the situation aje. Mbona time ulikuwa na nikatia kuniambia uko illuminati? Yeye akaniambia I'm very sorry. Mm-hmm. Singeza kukuambia. Mm-hmm. Ningelijua ninge, 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 nilikwambia <laughs> 
tutaogopa kuingia box akasema so it's okay so unaona tufanyaje then kaniambia wewe tukae tu pamoja tutaona vile tutafanya kamwambia tutaona vile tutafanya aje si pia mimi utaniingiza huku na mimi unajua mimi ni mcha Mungu spend hizo vitu za mashetani kwa zinanitisha sana i can't it's either we watch hizo mambo na illuminati then we join church akasema no way haizi then aka toka hapo akaenda amefura nikakaa tu hapo tena kaona simuongeleshe akarudi si nikaniambia vile tutafanya kamwambia kama uwezi change into illuminati waze kwa kama mimi itabidi mimi nirudi kwetu akasema hiyo mambo ya kurudi kwenu sitaki tutakosana hapa sasa hivi na utawaitoka nje tena kaniambia i'll force you to be in illuminati whether you like it or not so nikamwambia utanifosa aje na sita ingia kaniambia wewe jua tu by tomorrow utakuwa umeingia illuminati utakuwa umeanza kusifu shetani <laughs> ah, in one week's time utakuwa na gari utakuwa na wealth mingi utakuwa tu kama mimi sasa na kwamba hivyo ndio itikia yeah ni itikia wewe mm-hmm. zitaka vitu kama hivyo mm-hmm. kasema mimi si zitaka mm-hmm. elini struggle tu ni hustle nilikuwa mm-hmm. na wealth yangu hizo mm-hmm. vitu za kupata haraka haraka they are not good by the way mm-hmm. kasema okay ni sawa but i'll make sure umeingia lakini hapa utatoka mm-hmm. cuz you are now my slave kasema you are slave aje nikatoka nikaenda kwa huko city room hiyo mm. time sikuwa nimekaa kwa kiti juu najua nikikaa kwa hiyo kiti sasa ulikaa chini kwa jua kuna kitu kingine kwa hiyo nyumbani kwa chini kwa floor ah, ah. na vile stairs vile tiles na kuanga baridi mm. nikakaa hapa kaniambia sinta hebu kuja hapa kama utaleta kichwa ngumu kwa hiyo nyumba mm. baji tutakosana vibaya na nitakupiga mm. kamwambia sasa utanipiga mbona juu sitaki kuingia illuminati ama nini mm-hmm. tena kasema kani sawa kwa tu kiburi tu nikamwambia good night tulale mm. after that kalala then kidogo kidogo nilisikia kitu kama katapila na ni inaniangukia kwa mkono then nikashtuka kajiuliza hizi nini kutani hivi sioni tena hiyo jamaa then nikafungua light kajiuliza tena wewe mtu ameenda huko ama ameenda kwa hao mafuasi wake kuomba mm. then nikaenda kumsearch search then one of the bedroom kumbe one of the bedroom ndo wanaingianga wanaanza wanaanza kuabudu shetani in between that bedroom hapo katikati mm. yo jamaa so mm. that my husband alikuwa ameva nguo ya black ako katikati ya watu wameva white then hapa kwa forward yao imeandikwa 6666 then kila mtu ameshika boni iko na damu wanalamba wakiimba sijui satan what what then wanaita jina yangu oh, oh. by the way hata kwa ameni notice nimekuja hapo kaza kusikia Cynthia will come and enter with us Cynthia will join us Cynthia what what na wanaimba waki round kwa round hiyo boyfriend wangu nikatoka huko nikarudi bedroom then nikafunga light after kufunga light tena nikasikia sauti sauti nyingine ikivuma inaita Cynthia come Cynthia come sasa hizo ninaogopa nikabidi niombe Mungu hiyo time nilikuwa nimeanza kusema oh god sijui nini help me vile mtu anaimbanga nikasikia tu kitu imenishika tu hivi kwa I don't try praying here. Hapa mm-hmm. tutaki mambo na Mungu. Mm-hmm. Leo unaingizwa kwa Illuminati. Nikasema sita ingei. Sita sita ingizwa kwa Illuminati in Jesus name. Mm-hmm. Then after nilisema in Jesus name, mm-hmm. hiyo kitu ikapotea tena. Mm-hmm. Then nikalala. Sasa the next day. After nilikuwa nimelala the next day, nikapata hiyo boy kando yangu. Nikamuuliza, "By the way, unaendanga wapi?" Mm-hmm. Sasa so, hiyo time nilikuwa najua penye anaendanga. Mm-hmm ndio kwa nini nacho anaenda ni nyingine mm-hmm. kwa budu shetani mm-hmm. kamuliza ebu husband niambie tu kwenye ujenda usiku mm-hmm. cuz leo nayo uta ni future mm-hmm. i just have an evidence of that you always go at night then akaniambia kwani uliniona pale mm-hmm. then nikamwambia ya yeah. mm-hmm. ili kuona lazima open up niambie please ulikuwa mm-hmm. cuz vile naombanga mm-hmm. nilikwambia one day mm-hmm. Mungu atanifungulia nje na nitajua please unaendanga usiku mm-hmm. then akaniambia ah hapana mimi sikwenda pale. Mm. Akasema, "Ya kwenda pale na mdanganyishia siji nini nini. Simeamko kanipata hapa. Leo umeamko ukapata siko ama nimeingia na box vile naingia nayo." Mhm. Uh-huh. Akasema, "Ah ah, wewe niambie tu please ulienda." Mm. Sakata kusema, nikamuliza, "Jared, ile room nyingine nyeko empty huko kwa bedroom. Mm. Na tunaendaka kufanya nini na watu wengine?" Mhm. Akashtuka zile za hata ni kama li paint. Uh-uh. <laughs> Kamwambia hata after yeye ame faint mm. then after 30 minutes akaamka then akaniambia ah hiyo room nyingine mm. na kwanga na some of my colleagues wa job 
Kamuliza sasa mbovu yako leaves wa job kama kina nani? Mm. Enye mlikuwa mmeva vitu zenu hapo, mko mm. na bolu za damu, mm. na ni kama nasikia mnaita Cynthia. Mm. So hiyo time ndio mlikuwa mataka kuniingiza Illuminati. Mm-hmm. Si nilikwambia mimi amwezi niingiza cuz I have strong faith in God. Hakuna vile mnaweza niingiza. Then akasema so ulikuja kwa hii nyumba kuspike kila kitu niko kwa hii nyumba. Mm. Walai nikisikia anything out of this house mm. imetangazwa, mm-hmm. ni wewe utakufa. Mm-hmm. Kamwambia mimi nataka kwenda kwetu. Akasema siendi. Mm. Siendi, jua ni jua nikienda mm. tanza kutangaza tangaza hizo story mm. niende job ni sema siji this man is illuminati mm. za mkoa wa well chato mm. kama mbia that good thing mm. nishajua everything about you mm. mimi nataka kuangalia vile naweza toka kwa nyumba yako mm. siwezekana wewe nikatoa ring nikamrudishia mm. i don't want to be your wife anymore mm. kasema ebu va your ring labda ta your ring Nikamwambia labda ata irin na illuminati ya kuniingiza. Mm. Thanks to God I'm quite nimeingiza. Mm. Then akasema why your ring? Kakata kufa nikairusha. Mm. Kaniambia unarusha ring yangu. Unajua hiyo ring ina mimi nini? Mm. Sasa nikamwambia sio ring ina mimi mimi bibi yako ama iko na any other meaning? Mm. Then akasema okay ni sawa. Kama utakuta hiyo ring ni sawa. Mm. Akasema okay tulale. Then tukalala la la kufika kitu saa moja usiku. Mm. Na saa moja jioni. Mm-hmm kaniambia eti hebu amka nataka kuambia kitu tena uh-huh. na feel ni kama nataka kuniacha na utatoka kwa nyumba then nikamwambia ah mimi sitawe kukuacha mhm uh-huh. then license nikimwambia ukweli uh-huh. ataanza kushukuzuku then aanze kunyekea strict life mara na nifungia mlango uh-huh. kamwambia mimi sitakuacha nitaka tu hapa nitavumilia tu uh-huh. kasema ni sawa uh-huh. tukalala so the next day alifa kuenda job uh-huh. nilikwambia mimi hataki niende job ndio najua nitatoroka. Mm. So then nilifaka alifaka kwenda job morning after kuamka, mm. ikasema nataka kuunda plan ya kutoka kwa hiyo nyumba. Mm-hmm. Then hiyo time alikuwa ameenda bathroom, mm. nikamtime. Mm. Then nikaenda ku search search key. Siji nini ni run kwa mind yangu, nikajua naikanga key pale, then nikaenda nikachukua, nikafungua. Unaona tu vile niliamka kwa bed hivyo. Mm. Hivyo ndio vile nilitoroka nikatoka kwake. Hivyo. Nikaacha mlango wazi hivyo. Vile nilikuwa nimevaa tu hivyo nikilala mm-hmm. na vile niliamka. Hata nilitoka na mgutupu sikuvaa anything. Simu yangu pia nilisahau. Eh. Baji. Mm-hmm. Nilacha hiyo simu, nilijua nikitoka na hiyo simu, mm-hmm. atanifuata nisumbue. Mm-hmm. Na hiyo simu pia alikuwa amenininulia. Mm-hmm. Juu yenye nilikuwa nayo kwa anti yangu, iliwa kasi kuka dogo. Si unajua zile zinakwangana buttons. Mm-hmm. Niliacha kwa anti yangu, mm-hmm. then akanibaya ingine. Hiyo mm-hmm. pia niliacha. Everything ilikuwa amenibaya. Niliacha. Hata mm-hmm. viatu zilienda nazo kwake, niliacha. Then after kutoka huko nikaenda kwa anti yangu. Anti yangu alikuwa za what? Ile ya kushtuka. Mm. Kwani Cynthia umetoka wapi? Mm. Kamwambia yake anti nilikuwa kidnapped. Mm. Ebu Cynthia sema ukweli. Ungekuwa kidnapped ungekuja hapa hivi. Mm. Na umekuja after how many days? Mm-hmm. After three days mm. at umekuwa kidnapped. Kwani uliepa aje? Mm. Juu kama mtu amekuwa kidnapped mm-hmm. lazima utafutwe nini nini uwezi toroka peke yako. Mm. Then nikamwambia yake anti mimi siwezi kudanganya. Mm. Nilikuwa kidnapped. Mm-hmm sema hebu kuja hapa msichana uwezi nidanganya then nikamwambia yake anti i'm very sorry to say that why well, time nilikuwa nimetoka kwako nilikuwa nimeenda job na sikurudi aki siku kuambia please nilienda kuna jamu mwingine jamu mwingine hapo wa job nilimpata alinikatia then aka aka propose mm-hmm. ndio ni credit yake mm-hmm. so hata siji vile ali confuse mind yangu mm-hmm. so unajua unaona hiyo time mtu anakuwa kwa shida mm-hmm. una blame the other person mm-hmm. unajua vile mind yako ilikuwa vile itachange your mind mm-hmm. ukakubali ukaenda kwake mm-hmm. so ndio ilikuwa excuse yangu mm-hmm. then aunt yangu akaniambia wewe si nzia uta ni full si decision wewe ndio unafaa ku make hata kama ulikuwa umeenda kuoleka mbona ungeniambia mm-hmm. ni kwa advice na sipo kwenda kuelekea mtu mwenye wote ujui. Umejua wasichana wangapi washauliwa siku hizi? Mm. Ndio nikababia kwa anti pole. Mm. Haikuwa kupenda kwangu. Labda hiyo jamaa ndalikuwa na madawa. Mm. <laughs> Akaenda okay, change my mind yangu. Mm. So nikaenda tu na yeye hivyo bila kujua, mm. bila ku make decision. Mm. Then akaniambia, "Okay, ni sawa. So what happened? Yenye umerudi hapa hata bila viatu. Ana mwelekeza kila kitu. Mm. Kabolezea so, kila kitu. Ulikuja aje Nairobi. Nairobi. Mm kurudi Nairobi sio time nilikuwa kwa anti yangu Mombasa like sasa saa hii sasa hii tuko like oh, sasa hii kaja kwa kama Nairobi vile nilikuwa kama Nairobi nilikuwa naona huyo boy sasa nikilala kwa anti yangu mm. usiku alikuwa ananikuja tu kwa my dreams mm. akiwa uchi yani amevaa tu hiyo boxer yake then 
chest yake iko wazi ananiambia Cynthia come back Cynthia come back na ananiita zaidi Cynthia come back Cynthia come back mm. na hizo boys zao kama kuna nao watu wao wamevaa white wana round wana mm. round hiyo boy wangu anasema mm. Cynthia come back mm. nili mdream almost for night mm. na hata najaribu kuomba ananikuja tu kwa dream mm. anytime anakuja kwa dream mm. so the fifth night mm. alikuja in a different way mm. alikuwa amekuja amevaa ile mask ya kichwa wana vile mtu ada kwanga na skull sina just kali mtu mwenye amekufa mm. watu uso ni yake hiyo mm. uso ni skali yake but huku chini mitu body yake mm-hmm. then hapa kwa mkono yake nimekupa mifupa ya fingers then anifanyia hivi ni kama ataka kunikwara then nikashtuka kwa usingizi nikaomba mm. saa after kuomba tena kapotea mm. then nikajiza so what are these are coming to me mm. but then nilikuwa imeenda worst sana uh-huh. alafu i think the the nini shida nilifanya mm sikuenda kwa pasta immediately mm. ndio kama alikuwa ananisumbua sumbua hivyo na my dreams mm. so nikaambia nti yangu hiyo story so hiyo before nikuje Nairobi hiyo mm. time nilikuwa kwake Mombasa mm. then akaniambia mm. ati Cynthia you know your dream mm. utaitoa tukienda kwa pasta mm. kwa nikamuuliza twende kwa pasta yupi mm. then anti yangu akaniambia una huko place na Mombanga mm. unakonga na pasta mwingine mm. then hiyo pasta naweza kusaidia mm-hmm. so tomorrow sarauka very early in the morning mm. tutaenda kwa pasta so naona hiyo hiyo day tulifaa kwenda kwa pasta nilijamka kama ni kwa msik sana hata mm. siezi amka ni kai siezi amka ni tembe mm. then atukwenda mhm so after vile atukwenda kufika saa 5 ibaji nitaenda niko sawa so nashanga nini mbaya mm. ama ni hiyo boyenda ananifanyia hizi vitu mm-hmm. then nikamwambia aunt yangu mm. vile imeshindikana hivyo mm. acha mimi sasa nirudi kwangu Nairobi mm. I'll tell you everything happening. I think tutakuwa sawa. Mm. Cuz uko pia na isaenda church ni console watu wa nyumbi. Mm. So nikapanga vitu zangu nikarudi mm. Nairobi. Mm. Tutakurudi Nairobi mm. bengi ya kwangu. Mm. You know before niingie kwangu mm. kufungua light TV. Tena nikaona tu the same same man akiva hiyo skull then hizi zinga zake ni hizo mifupa mifupa. So mm. naona hizo skull za watu mm. na zinaganga mm. hata mm. vitu flash. Hmm. Na niambia Lucy utarudi na utarudi Mombasa au utarudi Mombasa. Hmm. Ya, nikamwambia usitarudi. Hmm. Then so time nimesema sitarudi. Nikasikia ni kama amen slab. Hmm. Then akanigwara hivi. But damu haiko inatoka. Alinigwara real but damu haiko toka. So nilikuwa nashanga. Mama sasa damu ijatoka. Hizo damu zimeenda wapi? Hmm. Na hiyo time nilikuwa nimeshtuka. Hmm. Then nikasema in Jesus name hmm. I cast you. Hmm. Then akapotea tena. Hmm. Tena nikakaa kajaribu kuomba na feel tu bado na stress ziko ananisumbua sumbua na feel tu ni kama kukukaribu na mimi so nikatoka nje tukaenda kwa jirani mm. kauliza jirani kama anajua pasta yote mm. anaweza nisaidia mm. then nikamwambia story zangu mm. vile napitia mm. hizo story tu zote ndio akanipeleka kwa pasta mwingine wao mm. then wakaniambia ombea dosi akukua na any improvement mm shida iliendelea tu hivyo mm. then the next day tena nikarudi nikaombewa mm-hmm. baada kuna improvement hiyo bwana nisumbua sumbua tu kwa dreams mm-hmm. then pia ananikuja physically mm-hmm. but uso yake uweziona unaona tu hiyo skull bado imagine zote nilikuwa nimepitia sana sasa the the seventh day nilienda nikaombewa mm-hmm. this nilianza kuwa na some nilianza kuwa na some improvement mm-hmm. at least nilishukuru Mungu nilisaidika mm. sasa niko sawa sana mm. hizo stress zake ziliisha hajai nisumbua tena hata kunitafuta kwa simu wako nitafuta mm. cuz i changed my number mm. nilienda nikikuwa na simu nyingine yeah mm. that was my whole story mm. so after that story i can advise my fellow ladies mm. before you get box ya mtu make sure umespa hiyo mtu many people wanaingia kwa relationships anashtukia hiyo boy ame date for 3 months mm. akona bibi oh. yes that is not worse than hii yangu hii mm. yangu unajua ni kwa illuminati mm. but wengine wanaingia kwa relationship zingine mtu mm. akona bibi mm-hmm. akona watoto wengine pia wakona other girlfriends but mm. they can't tell you hakuna mm. mtu anaweza itika kukwambia the negative parts of him mm. cuz there is something that they, they target mm. yeah so akwe careful sana mm. sasa hizi watu wengi wanauliwa most of my day unapata mtu social media anakukatia then kesho unaenda kuna meet unaanzaje ku meet mtu yes yes you complain hivyo juu pia mimi nilikuwa hivyo but hiyo ni too advice unalala mm. lesson careful mm. nilala lesson sana mm. but the good thing mm. nashukuru Mungu sana mm. i'm still alive mm. yeah god alinisave sana sasa hivi singekuwa 
kwa hiyo dunia nilikuwa nimekupa kitambo kwa zilikuwa very hard time mm. kutoka kwa hiyo nyumba yeah